scotch, bourbon and fried. If they like a bottle, they'll tell you why. Training C glasses, check. Training C coasters, check. Training, Training and C, check. C. Hey everybody! Welcome to another episode of Training C. I'm Training. This is C. We do risky reviews. For those of you who have not seen us, yeah, this is it. This is it. This is really as much as you this can is get. what we do. We are gonna dive deep into the Glen Ellick lineup, and we yes. are on to the twelve-year-old. Um, all of the month of November, we are sponsored by uh, James Bourne, Ooh. Glen Ellick. And uh, authentic wine and spirits. So it's yep. exciting. Thank you to them for uh, sponsoring our Dram Club, which you can get samples of this. Patreon.com oh, slash yeah. That's our little pitch that we do at the beginning of videos. Mm -hmm. You got kind of better with it. But hey, how else will you know to go get this precious bottle? <laughs> Super precious, clearly. I have no nails. You can't open the bottle, though. No. It's beyond preciousness. <laughs> they gotta stop biting these things. <laughs> My precious. <laughs> okay, here we go. Um, yeah, again, Glenelki. We've tried actually the 12 year old before. And uh, okay, get, it's, a look. get a look. At, look, at the look at the color. Freaking man. color. Non gel filtered, natural color. Look how dark that is. Can't look at. You can't even see Trini's bulbous head through there. No. And that's not with like a black label or anything like that. I'm shining my head currently. Look at that. Love it. There we go. Um, okay, let's do a quiet on set cork pop. Listen up, Three, everybody. Two, one. Just a nice pop. Straight pop, really. That's a straight pop. How's the pre glug though? <laughs> it's fine, fine, I guess. Yes. Okay. It's not the best prequel. We usually uh, rate a whiskey based on color, taste, uh, pre glug, nose. and pop. No, pop. color, and nose, taste, finish, and viscosity. Yeah. But I think from now on it's cork pop and, and pre, pre, pre glug. Yeah. <laughs> this gets a zero at this yeah. point. But anyway. <laughs> oh man, though. Mm. That's like. The nose is nice. It's like fruity. A, I was going to say, it's got a fruitiness to it. A little bit like a sherry kind of vibe to it, oh. but the um, it's got some sparkle to it. Like my nose buds are just kind of like humming a bit. I actually kind of get like a red apple, you know, like a sweet oh, yeah. kind of apple yeah. off of it. And then the classic honeys and those sorts of things, and obviously all Scotch whiskey is made from 100% malted mm. barley, so you're gonna naturally get that. But and the doughiness, the doughiness, yeah. which is a part of that. Let's give it a taste and return to the nose. Okay. Here we go. Oh man, I I think. Can I say what, what I think right off the bat? Sure. It has a nice build up to sweetness, and yeah. then it fizzles, like and not in a fade. It doesn't fade like it's still quite present, but it's like a literally like remember those fizz candies? Oh okay, yeah, it yeah. It's like. Pssst. It's sizzling like sodium. Fizzles. Yeah. It, it it doesn't uh, it doesn't fall off. No. Quite. It's actually quite quite the opposite. Rich throughout the whole thing. Yeah, and it, it has quite a like lingering like aftertaste to yeah. it. Yeah. Uh, uh, again, we've we have actually tried the, this uh, Glen Oak Twelve about a couple of years ago, three or four years ago, yeah. and uh, I I seem to be having a moment with it. Oh, I'm enjoying it. Um, but I think that there's like big multi notes actually on the on the flavor. Yeah. Yep. That like there's a little bit of it on the nose, but it's quite multi and nice and like kind of got this like doughy presence to the to the taste. And that kind of like it's almost like a a boysenberry, like really like berryish kind of like mm. walking through the woods where you pick a salmon berry or something like that on the flavor. Those are more like on the on the tart side too. Yeah, exactly. But like, there's- And that's a part of that sizzle. I think one of the like, if you think about the house style of Glen Ellicky, like to me, the house style is almost like this rich dark chocolate. Yeah, it has like a, a very is, malty chocolatey kind of vibe. Which is like a pretty good house style And this have. is on the fruity end of that, right? 
Yeah, it's almost yeah. like that dark chocolate that you get that has like the little fruit like pieces. fruits and nuts. Yeah, the fruits and nuts. Cadbury fruits and nuts. That's the, yeah. that's, that's the one. Um, Cadbury. If you need us to sponsor, you really talk to us. Yeah, Cadbury. <laughs> we'll be drinking whiskey though. They're like, why don't we just talk to Glen Ellen? <laughs> Why are we talking to you? Yeah, exactly. What do you guys have to no, do with No, no. We're the middleman. You need us. Yeah. You talk to them through us. Yeah. Um, sorry about that. <laughs> Again, Glenn Alkey comes together as a full presentation. It's got a 12-year-old. It's got natural color, non-chill filtered. And uh, in like reality, 46% this kind of percent, I think? all... Yeah, 40, 46%. And it's actually, like, I mean, our part of the world is a bit expensive, but... As far as like a... But at least you're getting all those things. You're getting all those things and it's not that expensive. Mm-hmm. Really. It's still in the $100 range, if not less. Yeah. Uh, in the States, it might be different. In parts of the UK, it's obviously way different. But still, not just a, a grocery store whiskey, you know? No. But like Heather Honeys, Vanillas, all that kind of stuff. But then with like the dark chocolate, fruity side, like... yeah. And it's sherry. Very, a sherry barrel thing it's very big and bold and like brown sugars there's lots going on on the nose like that's the other thing so anyways thank you for joining us tonight yes. we're Trenny and C uh, click like subscribe uh, join our Patreon yeah and uh, that's Trenny and C at, uh, slash patreon.com or whatever. sorry what is it if you know how to go to Patreon you know how to do it it's not an app, I guess. If you don't, well, you're not going to get Download that. Download the Patreon app and you're there. Is that it? <laughs> Can you see Patreon app? That should be good. Hey, cheers. Okay. Good luck with Patreon. <laughs> that commented that they were like the best part is that Trenny has no idea how to fucking get to Patreon <laughs> like say every video like, I've never ah. been on it in my life <laughs> <laughs> but the fact that your like signature is that you have no fucking idea how to do it but like part of your job is to like tell people to memorize it but I'm terrible with that with people too like this is brought to you by and I freeze like I'm in a job interview. Like <laughs> I have to finish it for you. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh my god, that's amazing. My brain turns to white static.